Alright, so... How do I start this? I don't even know where to start. Hmm. Yeah, this is, a. Uh, so, what's, uh, what's been going on with me? So, it is September 1st. Uh, what's going on in the background is Tekken 7 DLC for bowling. Ultimate Tekken Bowling has come out, but that's not the point of this video. The point of the video is to let people know what has happened or what's been going on with me in the past couple of weeks. Um, I believe two days ago, uh, I actually quit my job. I had to. Uh, it wasn't because, like, the work was too hard or anything like that, but I don't know how to put it into terms that wouldn't incriminate me, per se. I gotta put this, uh, pretty much. It, the place became hostile. It was a toxic environment. Too much toxicity, there was nothing I could really do about that. Uh, I was being targeted for slander. I don't know if it was because I'm a black man or anything like that. I really, I can't be too sure. I am gonna do something about it though. But the gist of it was, I wasn't being treated fairly. I wasn't being treated right. I was getting blamed for stuff that I was not responsible for. Uh, people pit pitting all these things on me that I had nothing to do with, accusing me of stuff that I wasn't even in the store for, you know? A whole bunch of fraudulent stuff, but I know I needed to leave. Look at Yoshi Mitsu, man, he's so fucking awesome in there. But, um, I, uh, I knew I needed to get away from there. I needed to be, I need to get away from there for like the longest time now. But I wanted to get another job first, but that doesn't seem to be in the cards. I did definitely try though. But ever since I did leave, I mean, it was, it was, it was really bad conditions to be working in anyway. Like, work just couldn't be work. It was always something else. I couldn't even have a day off without the stress of being called in. And this stuff has been going on since the beginning of the year. But it's just like the feeling of like being away from there. Just being away from that bad environment. That whole toxic environment. As I overcharge myself. Awesome. But to get away from all that toxicity and all that drama. All that all that stuff to be able to be away from all that you know it's somewhat of a liberating feeling because I knew I like I know I work hard I'm, I work hard I do the best I can every day but that wasn't that was never the problem it was always some underlying stuff that was going on what does this mean for me in the future eh, I think I could probably make more detailed videos until I find another job like right now, I'm just trying to take a break from it all, just to be away from that, just to let myself relax for a bit. That way, whenever I do get back into working again, whenever I can find another job, at least I can go back into it in a fresher state. I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have like the anger and rage and the stress and the overwork of what I was going through impacting me in the future. So I'm just getting myself away from that getting my mind retrained and everything for working um i do feel better I, I do think being away from there did make me happier in the long run but um as far as the future of my channel goes i might do commentary a bit differently i know there's the let's plays and uh tech and punishment guys that i was making i know i, I mean i put a small break to that because i was uh, everything was heading Everything was in a standstill because of work and everything. I do have some stuff ready to be uploaded. I just need to be able to go around and get to it. Look at me just frame that pin like a champion. I know. I know. But. To get back into it. Yeah, like I, I mean, I'm still, I'm still working on stuff. Uh, I got the Yakuza series going on. I just don't know. It's like as far as guide videos, I don't know which games to go to next. Uh, everything that's going on for me in the future is Yakuza. Uh, maybe some Fortnite videos. Maybe to get some folks into the into the thing and to playing Fortnite. If you decide to get early access of it. Um, I really haven't been playing multiplayer games. Uh, there's a there's a video series for Oni Chambra Z2 Chaos that I completely forgot about that I want to finish 
I want I like I'm trying to use this point to finish the things that I didn't finish as far as like my YouTube content goes um, maybe you guys can give me some suggestions on what games to play uh, I don't know I'm just I'm just I wouldn't say I'm Zen like I'm in a Zen mode or anything like that I'm just it's just like I can sit down and breathe for a bit just to be able to take in take in some stuff uh, Destiny 2 is coming out in about four days. Um, I was thinking about as far as oh my god, I'm just going off on a tangent here. Um, going back to Twitch and everything, like for streaming, I'm thinking about trying to build myself a community just to just to people just to feel welcome, you know. You know the people. Uh, there isn't enough of that. Like everything that I went through at work, I really don't like that, you know. But that just further motivated me to want to be able to make a place where people can feel welcome, people can relax. Uh, I'm not partnered on Twitch, but like all the people, all my friends, like Lee, Jazz, I miss Ross, <laughs> I miss Ross, Dazi, everybody else that streams and everything like that. Like I want to be able to do more for them, like not just because they're my friends, you know. That's these are the things that go on in my mind trying to do let's plays i know i got mass effect and drama going on I, like i was saying earlier i'm not in the multiplayer games anymore but i just i just know that i'm at a point to where i can start moving forward actually try to shout out people like shout out my closest friends just to help them out uh i'm just talking into the microphone now sorry i uh I do want to do. I do want to try to commentate this whole thing in one take. I know there's a bunch of pauses and everything. It's just. Oh yeah, another thing too. I know I, I posted one random video of me in Final Fantasy XIV. I'm actually uh, recently I got put into a raid group a few weeks ago, and uh, we're making good progress there too. Uh, maybe I can put that on YouTube as well. It's just I know I'm at a standstill. I know there. I'm not completely done with God Eater yet. I just know as far as like guide videos, I think I did make my last one there. But I say, hey, drop a comment. Let me know, uh, like, let me know what suggestions that you guys might have. I do want to be able to, uh, spare. Sorry. I know, like, I know I have, I have multiple options for the future. And I just want to be able to go about it as best I can, all while maintaining productivity in the social world. But yeah, if there's any suggestions that you guys might have, uh, I might find inspiration from other things that I might do myself. But I say, hey, I say, hey, talk to me. Um, probably, probably this will probably be the end of it. I quit my job. I am going to do something about that. I'm just not going to leave and take this sitting down. I'm going to do something about that. I just am going about it the right way. I quit my job. No more toxicity. Um, what else? Sorry. I quit, okay. Words. Quit my job. Got into a raid group. Not completely done with God Eater. I'm in a happier place mentally. I was. It was like wearing on me for a while but I got past it I know I'm good I just want to take some time out just to thank everybody and uh, hopefully you guys can give me a hand on the way into the future but the game was Tekken 7 uh, this was pretty much the same day as the ultimate bowling DLC has dropped my name is Eddie and I will see you guys later